So, a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. No, just the UK. So, <laughs> feels like a galaxy far, far away now. Um, I did a video on color mission, ADOX color mission. But the audio was atrocious. <laughs> It was so low. I, I got so many comments. People couldn't hear it. Um, and I didn't, I didn't have the like skills or the technology to like redo it. So, so I kind of, I kind of left it. I also did a collaboration with the Minus One Stop channel, who is an awesome photographer. Are we recording? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> got it. Since then, I've shot a lot more rolls of ADOX Color Mission, um, and I, I've been wanting to do an update video on it. And I thought this was a really good time because news of their new Helios film was just released. Let's go. I found it interesting that ADOX didn't release the Helios news on their English site. I found it on their German language site, and I translated it. And then I posted it on uh, Instagram and YouTube and just, basically asked um, people who spoke German to like double check the translation. I mean, Google Translate is usually pretty good, um, but basically what it said was, it is coming soon, it is being finalized in their factory in Switzerland. It only has four layers and it has extremely low sensitivity. The ISO of this film, three. They say it's super fine grain, it has some pastel -y colors, and that it is really good for long exposures. So if you're into long exposures, this might be a film for you. The sample images look super warm and orangey. Adox doesn't really put out much like in terms of marketing. So, I mean, compared to something like the Harmon Photo Phoenix campaign, that was massive. Um, Adox didn't really put this out. I just found it on their German language site. And when they manufacture something like color, like when they did Color Mission, they released it through their um, sort of partner store, Photo Impacts. So you could really only get it at Photo Impacts at the time it came out. And I got, I got it. <laughs> I'm guilty of being that person that ordered 20 rolls, but I had to order 20 rolls to make it worth it for the import taxes and the shipping. If the Color Mission experience is anything to go by, I would expect ADOX to release Helios at Photo Impacts only, and a lot of the German audience would be able to pick that up quite easily, um, but international people might struggle to um, find it, uh, order it, or have it available to them. It's definitely not like Phoenix, where Harmon made sure to send out that film so everybody could have it when it was released. But we'll see, we'll see. So that's Helios. So that's like a little bit of news, um, and I'm very excited to see when they're gonna release it. Now, in the release, it said they were gonna, they were talking about like next season. <laughs> so I don't know if they meant spring. I don't know if they meant next year, but otherwise I'll be looking forward to future German press releases. <laughs> so if, if you want updates on ADOX, then subscribe to their German newsletter, um, follow their German news site, and just translate everything. <laughs> and also, they came out with a 120 film. So they can now make 120 film, um, but that was also on the German site. That was not on the English site. Um, I don't know now, but when I checked it before I made this video, it definitely wasn't there. So. <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> All right, so that's Helios. Now let's talk about Color Mission. Let me know if you've tried this film. Let me know if you want to try this film down in the comments below. I really want to know, like, I mean, I've talked to a lot of people about it. I've talked to like who shot it, who hasn't shot it. Um, I've sent it to some people um, and I'm waiting to see their results. <laughs> Focal matter. <laughs> no, no pressure, no pressure. <laughs> I have to give a shout out to Eclect Chrome. Despite not eating any custard creams or bourbon biscuits, she's uh, she's all right. She's a good egg. What was I saying? Adox Color Mission. It is a brilliant film. It has been one of my favorite films to shoot in the last year or so. <laughs> It has a 
beautiful colors, beautiful saturation. It's an ISO 200 film. It has beautiful grain. I shot it in loads of different locations. I shot it in Portugal. I shot it in Krakow. I think I shot it in like five different cameras in five different places and got it processed by like five different film labs. <laughs> so. so I kind of have a spectrum of what it can look like. <laughs> actually talked about Helios like from the beginning. So their plan was when they released Color Mission, they had manufactured Color Mission with a partner before. Um, so they had all this stock of film that was being like preserved. So what happened was they released Color Mission and they said, we're gonna take the proceeds from the Color Mission sales and we're gonna use it uh, to invest in it, making our own from scratch color film. All right, so that is sort of like a, <laughs> a quick update video, a fun update video. I just wanted to share more of my results for Adox Color Mission and talk more about Adox and their films because I think they're an awesome company, even though they don't reach as much as other companies like Ilford or Kodak or Lomography. They seem to really kind of stay in themselves, like in um, their sort of local um you know, area, that area in Europe, in Germany. Despite that, they are still one of my favorites. And uh, I love their films and I love their chemistry. Their chemistry is awesome. Uh, they've got loads of like, you know, kits for developing and paper and stuff like that. So this video is not sponsored by Adox, by the way. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the video. Let's chat below and I will see you in a future video. Bye.